Hi. How are, how, hey, what's up? Welcome, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be doing another unpopular opinions video. A long time ago, like, I don't know, probably like five months ago, maybe even like seven, I don't even know, I posted an unpopular opinions video because around that time, unpopular opinion videos was like a huge trend and it's kindly, ki kindly? It's kind of not a trend anymore, but I wanted to do a part two. I've been wanting to do a part two for a while now, but like I haven't. I didn't really have like enough unpopular opinions for a video and I finally do so some of these opinions are kind of old sorry not sorry but I hope you guys enjoyed the video give this video a thumbs up subscribe down below if you're new turn on my I can't talk today that's not really new but turn on my bell notification subscribe I already said that let's just get started before I mess up any other word words oh god oh my god also you clicked on this video to hear unpopular opinions, so if you don't like my opinions, please no hate. I Some of these opinions are like, like I'm gonna get hate for, like I know, but I'm sorry, these are my personal opinions. No tea, no shade, just facts, just kidding. These are just my opinions. All right, so the majority of these unpopular opinions has to do with food, and I feel like food, unpopular opinions get the most hate because you know, everybody loves food. So, yeah, the majority of these have to do with food. First unpopular opinion, Cheetos are disgusting, period. I've never said period before, and people get annoyed by that word. I'm sorry. I. All right, anyway, Cheetos are gross. I like, I like the Cheeto Puffs. I love hot Cheetos, but crunchy Cheetos, those are disgusting. I can never eat those, like... When I get, like, the bags of, like, assorted chips, like, I would eat them for lunch, I would never eat the Cheetos. And I would just give them away to people at school. It's kind of gross that they like them, but, you know, I can't waste them, even though they're absolutely the most disgusting chips on the planet. Next food that I don't like, which may have a bunch of hate, chocolate ice cream. It's not good. It's not good at all. I prefer if I were to have chocolate ice cream, it would be soft serve. But it's really not that good and it's crazy coming from me because growing up I was obsessed with chocolate and I still am but for some reason I was never crazy about chocolate ice cream. That's like the one chocolate thing I'm not a fan of. I prefer vanilla. I feel like vanilla is so much better but chocolate ice cream is just not good. I have not met good chocolate ice cream and like I said soft serve chocolate is way better than like frozen chocolate ice cream but it's still not the best. Another food mushrooms mushrooms are gross and another food that i would talk about which i've already talked about in my first unpopular opinions video that i'll put in the i button maybe i always forget but if you're lucky i put the video up there for once i always forget to put videos in the i button but the one food i cannot stand is tomatoes i hate that food so much i'm sorry if you're like a big fan of tomatoes but i do not like tomatoes i like ketchup even though they're like not the same thing but like I just, I hate tomatoes, and I try to like them sometimes, but I've just never liked them. And I don't like mushrooms either. Mushrooms are gross. Okay, so the first unpopular opinion that doesn't involve food, um, this is, like, one of the uh, popular opinions that is kind of, like, old. Like, I made this list a while ago and just, like, started adding on, so it would be a little long of a list. Okay, so the whole James Charles and Tati Westbrook, I think her name is, T., I know this is, like, months ago, but, like, okay. I just want to give my opinion out there without, like, getting hate. Okay, I really don't have an opinion on that whole, like, scan scandal. That's not the right term. Like, the whole YouTube drama thing with them. Okay, so when it came out, I was shocked. And Tati's video came out first, and I was like, whoa. Like, I, I, I like, love James Charles. And I was not expecting, like, what she was saying. But then James's video came out, and I was like, what? And then she had another video, and I was just like, okay, what is going on? And as of today, like, months after the whole drama happened, I'm still confused, like, who to believe. Like, like I didn't really know who Tati was. Like, I knew of her, but I wasn't, like, a fan. Like... I was only on James's side at first because I was a supporter of James, but then I was like, okay, I don't know who to believe, and then the sister squad broke up, 
and it's just kind of like upsetting because I love the Dolan twins and I love Emma Chamberlain and Emma Chamberlain is still friends with the Dolan twins and the Dolan twins are still friends with Emma Chamberlain but they're not friends with James like they're not following him and I'm just like what is happening like I don't really know if actually like stuff happened with James like if what Tati said was true like I don't know but like I don't really have an opinion I just I'm just confused because it like came out of nowhere well for me it came out of nowhere because I was not expecting if any of the stuff Tati said was true I was not expecting like James to do or I mean I guess some of it but like some of it I was just like I don't know I don't know I'm just still like confused about the whole thing I know it's kind of like gone and like nobody brought it up like recently and I brought it back up again but yeah I don't know I don't know what was all with that situation um this next this next opinion I might get a lot of hate for but I've actually seen people agree with me with this one which I was shocked because I didn't think many people would agree with me um and if my friend Anissa comes across this video she's not going to really like my opinion at all but I don't like Billie Eilish's music I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm usually not I usually don't hate much on people on like singers but I'm not a fan of Billie Eilish. When she comes on the radio, I skip it. I, I don't... She She's a very pretty girl. She's very successful. Like, I'm not putting hate on Billie Eilish. I'm just not a fan of her. I don't really like her music. I don't know. I'm sorry. She's... I just don't like her music. I'm not... I, I want to make this sound like less... Like a, a hate thing. Which none of it's not. I just... Don't want to be like, yo, she sucks, like, she, like, should be off the radio. No. She's very successful, just not into her music. My next opinion is not, I don't think it will have a lot of hate. I think a lot of people will, will agree with me that Stranger Things is the best original TV show on Netflix. Now, I know that's a stretch because there's a lot of OG, you know, Netflix series out there, but I think Stranger Things is, like, number one. Or at least top three because it's a really good show. I watched season three in like a couple of days. Like it was that good. And I know some people are like, I can't watch a show like in like three days or like a day. But I can because I don't have, I don't have much to do in life. So I just watch Stranger Things. But I don't mind. I love that show and it was really good. Can't wait for season four because there's already been a leak that season four is happening. So love that. This next opinion is that Visco is not overrated. I mean, okay, it's kind of like overhyped, but it's not overrated. Um, at first, like, I don't think Visco had any hype to it. Like, people had it, but there wasn't much talk about it. And then there was a the whole Visco girl thing and everything. Like, I love Visco. I love the filters. I love, you know, editing my photos to make them look unrealistic. Um, but I just, like, I post constantly in Visco because I think I'm artsy. So follow me, you know, plug to my Visco account, at CaitlinLizzo4. Um, but yeah, most of my Instagram photos are edited by Visco. And I did do a video on me trying to be a Visco girl, which it wasn't really that hard to do because I'm already trying to, you know, be a Visco girl every day in my life. So if you want to check out the video, if I remember to put it in the i button, go check it out. But yeah, I don't think Visco is overrated. Yes, it's talked about, like, constantly, but... I don't mind it because I do, I, I like Visco, so follow me. And it's time for another unpopular food opinion. Peanut butter and jelly is not good. I, I feel like when I was little, like, it was okay, but as I grew up, I was like, no, this is gross. Like, if I have to have one, I will, but it's really not the food I enjoy the most. I, it, I just feel like the combination is really weird. And if anything, like grape jelly, another unpopular opinion, grape jelly is better than strawberry jelly. And that's kind of weird for me to say because I'm a bigger strawberry fan than grape fan. But grape jelly is better than strawberry. Anyway, that's not the point. Peanut butter and jelly isn't that good at all. Like, it's pretty gross. I don't really know who invented it, but it's not good. Okay, so I wrote the unpopular opinions um, in my notes on my phone, and then I wrote them down on this notepad because um, I'm filming with my phone. So as I was going through the list, I wrote TikTok is overrated or something like that, and then 
I recently just put it, I put in another on Pop Opinion today and I wrote TikTok is low key fun and I didn't even know that I already put TikTok is overrated and I was like, mm, oh how the tables have turned because TikTok is low key fun, not overrated. It's pretty fun. It's, it's kind of like a fun thing to do when you're completely bored, which is me 24-7. Like, at first, I was like, okay, TikTok is overhyped, it's boring, it's, like, too much, and then Jack, my best friend, got it, and I was like, oh, cool, and then I was like, you know what, I'm gonna get a TikTok, even though I had Musical.ly, I decided to make a new account, I was like, you know what, I'm gonna make a TikTok account, you know, start over, you know, not gonna go back to my cringy Musical.ly page, and then I was like, hmm, this started off as a joke, and it's not funny anymore, like, I'm, like, this is, like, really fun. So if you want to follow me on TikTok, because I think I'm TikTok famous, which I'm definitely not. I don't even have 100 followers. Only a couple of my TikToks have like 1,000 views, and I think I'm famous. But if you want to follow me, it's at CaitlinLizzo4. Same username as my Visco and my Instagram. Plug all my social medias in and be annoying. But yeah, I, I, I enjoy TikTok a lot because it cures my boredom. And it's, it's not stupid. I low-key think that TikTok is better than Musical.ly. Like... I don't know, like the whole hand movement thing, like I can never do that. That's why I just quit on Musical.ly. But like TikTok is a different thing and you don't have to do the whole hand movements. That's probably why I like it. That's probably why I'm on it like all the time. Next unpopular opinion, I never thought I would say in a million years, but Starbucks is better than Dunkin'. I never thought I would say that because I, a couple months ago, no, like last year, let's say, I was obsessed with Dunkin'. I would always get Dunkin', and when I would go to the mall, I would get Starbucks. But I would never get Starbucks, like, on its own. Like, you know, the Starbucks place, like, on its own, not in the mall. But I go all the time now to Starbucks. Like, all the time. Like, I haven't been to Dunkin' in, like, three months. And that's, that's like, the longest I've ever gone without Dunkin'. And I just go to Starbucks, like, all the time. Whether I, I go in the mall or the starbucks by itself or in target i'm always going and it's rare for me not to go to Star target well it's rare for me not to go to starbucks jack knows jack knows what i'm talking about because she's obsessed with starbucks too i'm i'm putting her on the spot right now but yeah i'm not i'm addicted to starbucks it's kind of bad my last unpopular opinion also has to do with food i told you all of them like the majority of them have to do with food um, Domino's is the best pizza company. Not Pizza Hut, not Papa John's, not whatever. Domino's is the best. And I know a lot of people don't like Domino's, but I disagree. I love their pizza, and every time my dad tells me we're ordering them, I'm just like, bless. Because my brother does not like Domino's, my mom's not a huge fan of it. So when we get it, it's a miracle day. Alright guys, so that was My Unpopular Opinions, part two. I hope you weren't triggered too much by these unpopular opinions. I know some of these were a little, little much because my opinion was strong that, you know, I don't like Billie Eilish or that, what else did I say? What else did I say that was like really like, mmm? Oh. Peanut butter jelly is not good. That's probably going to be, like, the most hated one. Comment down below any video ideas that you want to see on my channel. I am kind of running out. I mean, I have some in my phone, but if you have any, comment them down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe. Turn on my notifications. All that fun stuff so you'll be notified every single time I upload a brand new video every single Saturday. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.